hey guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to show you how to create a star rating and this is like a review let's say this is this is a one star and it's composed of unshaded star for example so if i change it into three star it changed into three star with two unshaded if i change this into one star it changed into one star with four unshaded so let me show you how to do this let's go to the application so in the sample application i have a services that i would like to rate so there's a room service food front desk and the table structure that i'm using this app is the services and then the uh, rating is an enum type which is one two three four five and this is a represent one two three four five star up to five star the first thing we need to do is to create a virtual column the purpose of the virtual column is um, the virtual column you see these stars uh, this is actually a virtual column so we're going to create that first so I'm going to name this say ratings and I'll just keep a formula empty and the type will be text let's say first then I'm going to create the UX so in the UX I create I use the deck type view and then primary header is the services that I would like to rate then secondary header this is a ratings this is the virtual column that you created and that's it then uh, we will create the stars using the format rules so you go to the UX and format rule let's create first our first format rule so this is for one star rating for example then the condition is um, the condition is the select rating which is a uh, range from 1 to 5 is equals to 1 so take note um, you have to do this in sequence otherwise the, the shaded star will come on the first like that so first you have to create the non shaded star so you can select this uh, select the virtual column that you created highlight it then here select the empty one okay and then what we're gonna do is we can just use this color and that's it so that's the for the first rating since the one star rating has it has a four unshaded so we have to create four of this so two three four and then that is four already then the fifth one star rating is we need to change the icon into this and change it the color into a yellow then let's save so as you can see we have here it's showing already one star then let's create the uh, second star or, or the two star rating so this will be uh, two star rating F same procedure uh, change the select rating is equals to two okay then highlight the virtual column select the icon since two stars has three um, three unshaded so let's create a three of this okay then so I have already one two three then the fourth one will be change this and then change the color and then the fifth star copy again that one and that's it all right so we're done for our second rating then let's create another format rule which is for the three star let's minimize this so this is for three 
star rating. So in three star rating, there are two unshaded stars like this. So let's change the condition. Select rating is equals to, oh, sorry, three. So we have to first create the unshaded. So we have already one, so we have to create two. So I've just copied this once. Wait before we copy. Make sure you select the virtual column, stars, then this gray. Then I'm going to copy this. Then the third copy, it should be this. And change this. So we have already one star. I have to copy this twice. Then that's it. Then save. So we're done for our three star. So for four stars, same goes. You have to create again. So this is for four star rating. So this is for uh, four star rating. So in four star rating, there are only one. There is only one uh, one unshaded star. So select rating is equals to four. Then highlight the virtual column. Select this. And that's it. Then we will copy this four times, but then we have to change these stars into this. So we have already one, two, three, four. Okay, the last one that we need to do is the five star. Five star doesn't have a shaded, it's a full yellow star. So what we're gonna do is just five star. Uh, this is select rating is equals to 5 so we can just uh, directly select the virtual column this and this so we're going to make four of this so so already two I mean five three four five and save all right so that's the first part So we have the 5 star, 3 star, 1 star, and 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Now let's create to have an icon here. Uh, this is for the, uh, uh, for the user to review it. So to do that, let's create an action. So first, let's going to create an action for the room rating. I'm going to name this room ratings. Okay. So I'm going to set value column of this row. So I'm going to uh, here, since uh, this is a free input, I mean, user should um, select which rating. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the expression in input. Input, then what is the column? So the column is select uh, rating. What will be the input? Just keep it empty. Okay, and then um, this will be available only if the services is equals to room. All right, so that's our first action, and uh, that's it. Then I'm going to copy this, and this time it's uh, um, services. So service service rating and then I'm going just to change this availability if this is equals to service then we have the food I'm going just to copy this then we have the food okay then I'm going to have the display services is equals to food then we have here the uh, front desk. I'm going just to copy this. So this is front desk. And then behavior, I'm just going to change this. So this is this action is only available in front desk. All right, let's save. Then what we're going to do next is um, let's going to fix our UX so now I have here the ratings 
I'm going to the view and attach that actions that I created. So here we have the uh, room ratings, I have the service ratings, and I have the food ratings, and I have this front desk ratings, for example. So we have this icon, we can customize the icon also, but this time no need. So let's try to test our star rating if it's working. So for room rating, it's five stars, so you can change it. Let's see, I'm going to make it one star. As you can see, it's change. You can change it back to three star. Change as well. Let's say service, one star. As you can see, food, let's say five star. And front desk, let's say four star, as you can see. So this is how to create the uh, uh, ratings or feedbacks or I don't know what you call that using format rules. If you learned something in this video, don't forget to subscribe or comment if you have any questions. And thank you so much for watching. See you next time in my next video.